Hey guys, today I will be showing you how to make butter slime. This butter slime is so soft and so fun to play with and it, it makes a lot of poking noises. So let's get on to the video. You will be needing a bowl and something to mix with. I'm using like a bowl and a spoon. Some shaving foam. Baby lotion. Baby oil. Baby powder, foaming hand soap, cornstarch, and the cornstarch and baby powder have to be together or you can use a two-in-one from the Dollar Tree, cornstarch baby powder. And you will need slime activator. I'm using borax, but you can use laundry detergent or any some, or something else. And some school glue. I'm, I use Elmer's and some model magic or any soft clay. So let's get started. So the first thing you have to do is take your bowl and add in some glue. And I just realized that um, my my gallon of glue is almost finished and it was hard to get out so I paused the video after and I waited for all the glue to come out and I didn't use too much My glue is coming out very slowly. Sorry about that, guys. So I finally got the glue in. And now I added some lotion and all the other ingredients. Lotion, cornstarch, baby powder, baby oil, um, shaving foam, and white foaming hand soap. And there's no particular step you have to add them in. You can add them in any step that you want. And if you want, you can add in the ingredients one at a time and you add it in, add the ingredients in and then mix the add the other the other ingredient in and mix. Or you can just add them all at one time and mix once. That's what I did. Now is the time to add in your borax. Make sure you add the borax in slowly or else your sign will be a clump, a big hard clump. Keep on adding the borax and mixing until it has formed a very nice texture of slime. It might take some time if you are very careful. And that is a good thing because if you are careful and you take more time on making it, the better it will turn out. When it is the right texture and doesn't look too sticky and isn't sticking to the bowl, take it out and start kneading it until it is not sticking and has formed a super soft texture. Then you can add in your clay or model magic. I'm using model magic. And I'm sorry I didn't have any yellow um, color for like butter. That's the only color I could find. So then just knead it in, and the color of the uh, clay that you're using, the color of the slime it will be. And the clay makes it a softer and like the butter texture spreads more and spreads more than usual, like regular slime. And now I'm gonna spread it. See how it spreads. It's 
but so good. Bye.